Well, Paul Joseph is manning Groundhog Central tonight. There was quite a difference between last night's snow and Thursday's snow, wasn't there? That's right, John. Thursday's snow, we had a lot of moisture with it, and you yeah. probably remember us digging the cars out behind <laughs> oh, the studio here. Do <laughs> I ever that. remember that? Yeah. Really tough and real bad on the driving. The snow last night was more of the, well, it was very dry snow, and so it was easier to get it off the cars, at least. I didn't have any trouble getting out of the station. 27 this afternoon was the high temperature in Milwaukee, 21 the morning low. Officially at Mitchell Field, 1.9 inches of snow last night, 6 inches on the ground. We've had 12.3 inches so far this winter season. And you might be interested, uh, some of you appreciated the sun, saw it come up for a while this afternoon, first time in about a week. It's set at 417, and that's the earliest it's going to set for the season. It'll start becoming later and later now as the year goes on. Let's take a look at the local area chart, get some idea of 10 o'clock temperatures around the state. You'll notice we're in the northern part of the state. There are temperatures chilly, generally temperatures 16. There's a 6 up at Duluth. Temperatures are in parentheses, and we've got the snow cover in inches. And you can see the greatest snow covers in the southern part of the state, 14 inches in Madison, 6 in Milwaukee. Notice the warm temperatures in southeastern Wisconsin. We have a cloud-covered Dubuque, 13 degrees. It's clear there. The snow causing the temperatures to go down quite a bit. Well, on the weather map, first of all, here's the low pressure systems that caused us all the snow Thursday and again last night. A big area of snow this evening from around New England down into the Appalachian Mountain Ranges. Eight to nine inches across New York and the New England states. 21 below zero at uh, Houghton, Maine was the nation's low temperature. And the cool air from this particular system has gone all the way south into Florida. Didn't quite reach West Palm Beach, though, today. 85 degrees was the high. That was the highest in the nation but only in the 60s in northern Florida and the 50s in a good portion of the south as the cool air moved toward the Gulf of Mexico. But this high is kind of significant, I think, for our weather because it's starting to pump moisture up the western portion of the high. In fact, we have an area of clouds that looks something like this starting to move up in Texas. These clouds perhaps could be the culprit, give us some rain to come Wednesday, probably rain mixed with snow. Temperatures today, Oklahoma City, 52. Warmer air coming up from the south. 48 today in Kansas City. It was 32 at Rapid City, South Dakota. But we have an Arctic front moving into the northwestern part of our state. Only 11 at Fargo today. If we go way up here in Canada, you don't want to hear about this, but it was 25 below zero <laughs> over a good portion of Canada. We'll just ignore that. Phoenix had a 73 this afternoon, 66 in Los Angeles. This is sort of, I suppose, scientifically, we'd have to call it a puny sort of front. Nothing at all going on associated with it. Some showers along the west coast. But as I mentioned before, as this moves toward our area, probably pick up some of the moisture from the south. Well, we'll talk more about the forecast in a minute. Tonight's exclusive News 4 Radar Weather, brought to you by Shell Furniture. Hi, I'm Judy Marks, and what better way to rock than in an Ethan Allen or Tell City Rocker from Shell Furniture? These popular priced rockers are more comfortable and decorative than ever before. When you see them, you won't be able to resist the temptation to rock. So go ahead. You'll love their soothing action. Best of all, rockers add a warm accent to any setting. Choose styles upholstered in bright prints or finished in hand-glazed, hand-decorated colors. Rockers are great attention getters, too. They're the goal of all guests, the favorite of all children. Rockers make wonderful Christmas gifts for all ages. See the beautiful selection of Ethan Allen and Tell City Rockers at Shell Furniture, North Avenue at 55th, for all your decorating dreams come true. Now, those of you interested in feeling or knowing how cold you're going to feel this winter, News 4 has wind chill charts available. You can pick them up here at Radio City or the Journal Building downtown. And if you send us a self-addressed stamped envelope, we'd be happy to send you one. Know how cold it's going to be. Let's take a look at the satellite picture right now, get some idea of the cloud formations across the country. What we've done is we've superimposed the surface weather map on top of the satellite picture. Here are the extensive clouds in New England and the, the Great Lakes region. Here's the low pressure center causing the snow throughout the region. These aren't clouds through here. That was the heavy snow belt Thursday and Friday that moved through southern Wisconsin. These are the clouds we have to worry about, the moisture coming up from the Gulf of Mexico, possibly affecting us late Tuesday or Wednesday. So as this front moves toward the region, that's what we're going to have to worry about, this moving toward the Midwest and the moisture moving up from the south. These two factors may produce some precipitation later in the week. Let's take a look at the current conditions right now. At the present time, the winds are out of the west. 
wind velocity about 13 miles per hour, temperatures 28 degrees, it's 21 at Mitchell Field, humidity 76%, barometer 30.08 inches and rising. The radar is clear, so the forecast. Tonight, partly cloudy and cold. Low around 14 with the clouds, but if the clouds clear away, we could get as low as 10. Tomorrow, partly sunny, the high around 28. Winds westerly tomorrow, 8 to 16 miles per hour. Good flying weather. Tuesday, increasing clouds, a little warmer. Cooling weather, Wednesday and Thursday. That's the weather report for this Sunday evening. More news right after this. News for exclusive radar weather was brought to you by Shell Furniture, North Avenue at 55th, where all your decorating dreams come true.